Hello everyone, Nosy here aka Icon7 and today I'm gonna show you guys a updated tutorial on how to 360 in Dead by Daylight. Now, a few months ago I did make a lot of tutorials around Iron Tech, Iron Tech Reverse, 360, Flashlight Save, Moonwalk and more and more. But as you can see, this is a few months ago, so I decided to update every single one of them starting off with the 360. Now, as we all know, or at least most of us know, there is a lot of variations on how to 360 and Dead by Daylight, and I can't even count them on one hand, there is a lot. So in this case, in this video, I'm gonna start off with beginner, because as I said, this video is made for everyone, and maybe in my next video I'm gonna start more advanced, and then in my next video, even more and more advanced, then we are talking about actually moonwalking while 360ing. So, First of all, I want to show you guys some examples on how a 360 looks like. This is with a flashlight, this makes it a lot more easier as you can see right here. Now, as I said also, there is a lot of variations from beginner to advanced to legendary. And as you can see right here, just a few variations. But obviously we're gonna start off with beginner. Also, don't feel too stressed. It will take some time to learn. And remember guys, I was once a beginner too. When this game came out on console in 2017, the only thing I did was run away from a killer, panicking, dropping every single pallet and then go down in 10 seconds. But that's fine, you know, because we're still learning. And my advice is to start from the beginning. Don't jump to the next step too fast. Try to learn every single step very good and then you can move on to the next step. Now, the most important thing that is getting overlooked is the sensitivity settings, because when people hear about 360ing, they forget about the sensitivity and they only think about the controls. So right here guys, my advice is to use a sensitivity that is 75% or higher. So the higher you go, the better the results. So you can also go 80%, 90%, 100%, but the lower you go from 75%, it will be a lot harder because your character moves a lot slower. And we all know that if you go against PC killers or even PS4 that have a higher sensitivity it will be a lot harder to 360 them now here is another tip if you're on console and i'm saying this because there is also pc players playing with a controller but if you're on ps5 xbox or ps4 turn off crossplay if you turn off crossplay you will only go against people on the same platform as you so for example i'm ps4 if i turn off crossplay i will only go against ps4 killers and it will be a lot easier because they have the same sensitivity as i do sometimes they even have lower but if you're on pc and you play with a controller do not turn off crossplay because you will only go against pc killers with a high dpi now, after you finished with all the settings, you can finally move on to the controls on how to 360. Now, I took this example, so as you can see right here, I'm getting chased by a legion. Added T-Wall. This legion thinks I'm gonna vault the T-Wall window. But in fact, what I'm trying to do right here is, I'm trying to hide line of sight so I can turn counterclockwise around this legion by clicking my flashlight. So as you can see right here, this legion thinks I'm gonna go for the window, but in fact, I'm clicking my flashlight right here, and with my left joystick, I'm gonna turn counterclockwise around the legion, and with my right joystick, I'm gonna move it horizontally, completely to the right side. And this is, this is how it would look like on a controller, guys. Now, as you can see, I'm gonna hold the running button, because obviously I'm running away from the legion, Right here, my joystick is facing the window and I'm gonna turn counterclockwise and move my right joystick completely to the right. So this is how it looks like. You hold the running button, run, turn counterclockwise while moving your right joystick the right side. Now the same thing goes with Nemesis right here. As you can see, this is just the opposite direction. I'm clicking my flashlight and then I'm gonna turn my left joystick clockwise around the nemesis while moving my right joystick completely to the left horizontally. So as you can see right here, I'm still running away. Right here, I'm facing the car as you can see. Then I'm gonna click my flashlight and then turn clockwise around nemesis while moving my right joystick completely to the left. So this is how it would look like.
Now, when it comes to the controller, PS4, PS5 and Xbox are the exact same. When it comes to sensitivity and controls, they are the exact same. And this is the most important. The sensitivity and the controls, this is the most important. The layout of the PS5 and the PS4 controller are a little bit the same, but the Xbox, the joysticks are a little bit in a different position, but that doesn't ch change the fact that the controls and the sensitivity are still the same. So that's pretty much it guys. In the rest of this video I'm going to show you guys some examples on 360s that I had in my games. And yeah guys, with all of that being said, thank you so much for watching and see you in the next video. Take care. These are all fake, faking it. Beautiful. This one is a fake one as well, this one is a fake as well. Faking it again. Nice. We do have Shaq, Shaq is real. Nice. Let's go for 360. 60 sensitivity, so... Beautiful, it worked. Faking it again. Nice. Again. Beautiful. Nice. Let's drop it and dump tech. Again. Oh my, 60 sensitivity. Beautiful. Nice. Let's fake it again and then actually you vault it. Nice. Oh my. Please don't DC, please. Okay. Oh wait. Yeah, he's he's still pulling behind me. Yeah. Nine million IQ mind game. Oh, he double backed, okay. <laughs> I actually wanted to 360 him right here, but... Ah, oh, we can wait here. There he is. Let's fake it again. Nice. <laughs> oh my. He put a fake pallet at Shag. Beautiful. Nice. Let's fake it again. Nah, never mind. I got too greedy there. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright. I didn't want... Nah, I'm not gonna take it from the outside. I don't know. I don't know what's wrong with this Freddy, to be honest. They did the last two gens. Beautiful. Let's take it for real now. Let's vault it for real again. I think he, he's assuming we're gonna fake it, but no. Let's zigzag again. Nice, that was a close one. Again. Yeah, we're pretty much dead here. These are all fake pallets. <laughs> GG's. Yeah, we're getting face cam. There is no way this guy's gonna let us out. Interesting. I didn't expect him to do that. 360. Perfect. It's kinda easy to 360 his uh, power. Because he needs to be very precise. Oh my god, what is he doing? I'm here. <laughs> Let me take a hit for you. Run away. Or let me just do this. Why is he so greedy with his power, dude? Uh, okay, he's getting dizzy. But I'm getting dizzy as well, to be honest. <laughs> Okay, no, no. That doesn't work. <laughs> okay, but that was a Y360. <laughs> Not gonna lie. I actually don't know how I pulled that off. Let's try again. Oh my god, dude. What is wrong? Beautiful. I mean, I'm pretty safe here. Once I get hit, I can just leave. To be fair, I don't know how we did that, but um, I'm happy I played it uh, very safe at the beginning. I think if I didn't play it safe and I played it too greedy, I think it would have been GG. The infinite, but I'm staying here. So my frames like start dropping like here and then, but especially when he hits me with the power. Let's go for 360. Yes sir, let's go. Oh, we can just 
take it back. I'm gonna stay here. I feel uh, conf comfortable here. That was a close one. There was a zombie, 360. Yes, sir. Again. Okay, that didn't hit me. Interesting. We can do it again. I got now, I know this is a fake pallet next to you, so I'm gonna drop it and take aggro. Just so I can get him on me. There he is. Nice. Yes, sir. Again. Never mind. Okay, there he is. He's ignoring... Okay, he's ignoring the people on the hook. Oh, he doesn't respect them. He's, re he's really fast. He might have no head. He looks pretty fast. 360 again. Nice. I don't think this guy's gonna let me out of this hook. Yeah, <laughs> I knew it. Okay. I just hope they have enough time now to open the gates and uh, leave. Because I don't want to risk it. Oh yeah, wait. Yeah, it's the new animation. I can't kill myself quick enough. One more. One more skull check, come on. There you go. I mean, I'm not gonna lie, that was a fun game. As long as my team can escape, I'm happy. GG's.